but I'm happy October is here. <laughs> I'm happy that you're happy. Yeah, I'm so happy. I'm going to plant me a, a big pumpkin on my step that I pick out of the pumpkin patch. <laughs> Yeah, can't wait to go to the pumpkin patch. I'm gonna pick a pumpkin as big as a uh, as a as a watermelon. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you're gonna do that. I'm happy. I remember when you all were uh, planting seeds back in the spring. Yeah, I had my friends and me, we were volunteers in the old pumpkin patch, and we planted good seeds. Yep. Yeah, I sure gladly. October is finally here. October reminds me of harvest time. Yeah, it reminds me of the harvest time, too. What's that? Uh oh, I think somebody's texting me. Oh, you're going to read it? I'm going to read it. Breaking news bad crop of pumpkins. Pumpkin patch is closed. I, I, I don't believe it. I just read you the text. Breaking news. Bad crop of pumpkins. The pumpkin patch is closed. And I didn't read, read the last part of it, but it said the reason. Well, there's a reason it was closed. Weed seeds. Weed seeds? What in the world is that? Weed seeds? It sounds like a disease. No, it's not a disease. But it can be worse than that because it's real sneaky. Weed seeds? You must have planted some bad seeds or something. I didn't plant any bad seeds. They were good seeds. Top of the line pumpkin seeds in the pumpkin patch. Well, the text said there was weed seeds that grew up and into weeds. What do they do? Well, weed seeds grow into the weeds and they get big and they choke the plant, the pumpkin plant or any plant. Oh, Louie, I planted top of the line seeds and I don't understand. An enemy has done this. A thief. Yeah, to sneak in my pumpkin patch. Makes me sad, makes me mad. Well, you know, the Bible talks about that. It does. We should talk about that. It talks about it in Matthew 13, verses 24 and 25. And a man came and planted good seed, just like you did in the pumpkin patch. Yeah, and while he was away, like me in school, an enemy came and planted weed seeds. Yeah, and you know, weed seeds grow up and they choke the life out of whatever is in its way. That's sad. I'm mad, mad, mad. Mm. Man, I'm mad. <clears throat> Don't like this. You know, churches, I've been told, actually plant weed seeds too. Weed seeds? How do you grow weed seeds in a church? They got a carpet in here, not dirt. Well, weed seeds get planted in the church when people don't believe the truth of the Bible. Oh. And good seed is planted in the church when people believe the truth of the Bible. Oh, I like that. Yeah, I like to believe the truth. Yeah, you got to do that. So what we need to be careful about is pulling out those weed seeds so they don't grow. Yeah, don't let weeds grow uh, in the pumpkin patch. And don't let weed seeds grow in the church. No, no, you don't want to do that. And, and don't let weed seeds grow in your life either. You got that? You got that? So whenever you see weed seeds, be careful, because you know weeds are going to be growing soon. And when you see them weed seeds, you got to yank them out. Pull them out. Pull them out. You got to do that. Yank them out. And in the meantime, when you're thinking about that, Talk to God in your journey, and he'll help you bob and weave around those weed seeds. Selah. Meditate on this.